Right, I'm here with Scott Sayward and um, his opponent's been a no-show. Mate, I've been watching him training in the, in the backstage as well. His kicks are lethal, his punches are lethal, he's a massive lad. I was really looking forward to this fight as well. How do you feel, mate? I'm absolutely gutted. I was looking forward to this fight. I've been training for months, mentally preparing, physically preparing, in the best shape of my life. He obviously saw that and didn't want to fight. Now, do you say you went to fight him before, is that right? Uh, my first professional fight for UCMA 27 was, uh, yeah, the UCMA 27 was lined up with Marion Husu. And he phoned Dave and said that he didn't want to fight me because I'm too big and he wanted a bit of an easier fight first. I fought on that show, I won I, in, uh, by TKO. Then I fought on the next show and I lost, unfortunately. And he must have seen me lose because he phoned Dave and asked for, the, asked for the fight again. And he's asked for the fight, turned up to the weigh-in, seen I'm in better shape and then melted, consequently. Dropped out, dropped out. I see everybody running around going mad about it. Now just tell us a bit about your background, mate. What, what are you actually trained in? How did you start? Uh, started with Ian over here when I was six years old in Shotokan Karate. I've done that for nine years. Nine years. I basically trained with Ian, Charlotte, Stephen and Shane my whole life. Been training karate, then uh, moved on to Sancho and boxing with Ian. And then uh, found MMA at the age of about 16, 17. Been training that ever since. Excellent, excellent, mate. So you're an independent fighter. Independent fighter, fighting, um, training at Karma Gym in Erith with uh, John Gnor. Big thanks to him and training with Brute Camp. Solely responsible for getting my fitness to the level it is. Excellent. And uh, is there anyone in particular that you would like to fight, aside from obviously Mario, who never I shows. just wanted to fight. I wanted to fight. Anyone, anyone. I just wanted to fight. I was looking for. I was looking forward to this fight because I haven't fought for ages. So I had a string of fighters pull out. And then it's pulled out in the last second when I've got mentally ready. I've trained myself to the ground. But I'm going to use it as uh, mental ammunition for my next fight. OK, mate, well, we'll set up a case show soon. Hopefully we can find a fighter for you. It's an absolute pleasure meeting you. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, sir. And they better try and sneak him out the back door because, uh, I mean, he's just useless. If he wants to be a fighter, then he's got to come and fight. If he's he don't, he wants, show. He wants to take up knitting. Yeah. <laughs> Jim's shouldn't start let the, knitting, start knitting. Jim's shouldn't let the man in to train because he's a disappointment to the sport. Okay, thank you. Thank you very much, lads. Thanks Take care, geezer.